indicate that that's what you're doing to him, you see. Everything you need in fighting is included in your, well, we call it double joining hands to, di to divorce us from the more normal thing you just saw then. So every attack and defense is available to you here. Wah! There's one there. Ah, there's one there. Ah, there's one there. Ah, there's another one there. Fingers to the eyes and so on. So every available attacking method is, 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 is available to you from your double push hands. Because all double push hands is, is pang hinge. See, everything we do in Tai Chi is pang and hinge. In that position, there it is there. He's doing it already. Because he thinks I'm going to hit him. <laughs> That's your pang hinge. In that position, you're, you're, you're well defended. Just attack Eli, you're well defended. <laughs> From that position, you can immediately launch into any sort of attack you want because it turns into pun hinge, you see? And you're not going to exacerbate a situation in a pub, for instance, where there's some aggressor there, some drunk bloke, and you don't want to kill him. So you just, you don't stand like this. This is going to make him worse. You just stand like this, try to talk him out of it first. But you're protected in this position, you see? You're well protected, ready for anything that happens to you. So the, your double push hands is the epitome of esoteric or abstract self-defense, taking it into your reflex actions or into your subconscious mind. Now, from your double push hands, this is the norm, of course, and we 